Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1751, where we have 40 moves to collect 86 frosting, 14 chocolate, and 8 wrapped candies in order to make 50,000 points. So the first thing we need to try doing in order to accomplish that is to remove as much of this frosting as we can. And notice I'm setting myself up to make some specials as I go, because we have this order fulfillment here, and just because they're so handy at making things go boom. I would love to get these two to combine. I don't see that as a potential right now. Um, the reason I'm making these moves directly under, you know, in the central areas, because I'm also making them directly under this popcorn. And I want to do that because if I can release this popcorn, then uh, not only do I get a color bomb, which is a significant help, but I also then uh, release the UFO, which has three more of these wrapped candies. And the most important thing to that is that they will target the frosting. And I say, should say that they usually target the frosting. There is an exception. Let's say I make a uh, striped color bomb combo, and before I pop the popcorn, the UFO gets ignited. Then what will happen is they'll probably attack the popcorn. Oh, gosh, I would love to get these combined. Not seeing it happen, and my primary objective is to cut through as much of this frosting as I can. I need, hopefully by move 20, to open up the spawners so that I can get some of this chocolate generating. Again, I see an opportunity to make a color bomb, but I don't see it as a significant opportunity. I don't see how to get a purple there very easily without really expending a lot of moves. So instead, I'm going to go for clearing out that frosting. If I can clear out the frosting significantly more quickly than move 20, which it looks like I'll be able to do, I'll have a lot more freedom to do this collection. I'm going to take out this popcorn, or this up. Uh, chocolate. I've got enough time. And two of these set up, which will help me to take out this frosting if I can ignite them. And this frosting is so tough. Okay, well I couldn't quite do that. I'm still going to work on the frosting while I'm allowing the chocolate to grow. And hopefully the chocolate will ignore these. Sometimes it ignores um, parts of our order. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, I still have 17 moves, and the chocolate's still going to be generating. Now I think is a good time to start kind of uh, not worrying about whether or not I take out the chocolate. And just getting all of this frosting gone. This is likely to be consumed. And I don't see an opportunity to strike any more of the frosting. And I don't see, oh, I kind of do see a special brewing here. Huh. Not quite what I wanted. I don't see a way to get that down to communicate. I think instead what I'm going to do Oh, I'd love to take out all green if I could. I'm going to do this. I'm going to make a move that then sets that off and takes out any random color. Uh, because that's an efficiency of moves when I can do that. So now I need to target this frosting, and that's kind of all I need to do. I've got my last who's a Mowetsi on the board. So I just need to get into these areas where the frosting is hard to reach. See if we can make another combo here. Ooh, if I could drop that down one more, that would be spectacular. I can't, so I'm going with what I have. 
Can I pair this with a special? No, so I'm going to remove all red. Concentrating those colors, giving me the opportunity to make more matches and specials. Here we go. Huh. Okay, taking out all blue. And this is how I go about beating level 1751. Uh, again, it would have been a bonus to get this, but I didn't focus on it, and I was still able to accomplish my mission. If you want to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks so much for watching.